The annual seven-day Hong Kong Book Fair kicked off at the Hong Kong Convention and Exhibition Center today. This year, those who've purchased book fair tickets can also visit the Hong Kong Sports and Leisure Expo and World of Snacks on the same day with no extra charge. Christy Khan tells us more. The Hong Kong Book Fair is being held as scheduled this year despite the city's recent surge in COVID cases. Following the opening of the exhibition center MTR station, some visitors arrived via the metro. More than 30 book lovers could be seen queuing outside of the venue ahead of the start of the fair. Some of the early birds arrived at around 5 in the morning. Visitors had to use the Leave Home Safe app and meet the vaccine pass requirements to enter. At 10 a.m., the book fair officially opened, with visitors rushing to the exhibition halls in order to hunt for their favorite books. This man said he would spend around $2,000 to get some exercise books for his children, noting the prices of the books in general had gone up. Apart from novels, exercise books and non-fiction publications, books related to President Xi Jinping were stacked up in some stalls. But other types of books were harder to come by this year. This book fair exhibitor said he rarely found political books about Hong Kong at the book fair. He added other publishers and authors have become more cautious about their displays after the national security law came into effect. <laughs> Meanwhile, Chief Executive John Lee attended the opening ceremony of the book fair. In his opening remarks, Lee emphasized Hong Kong is a metropolitan city which can connect the mainland with the outside world. Lee added it is of paramount importance that the city should continue to play its role in promoting East-West cultural exchange. Christy Khan, TVB News.